future is a Futurama without Bender! Bite my shiny metal ass! No, no Bendy, no Futurama! No, no Watchy, no Bendy, no Watchy! You make a persuasive argument, Fry! That's my line and I'm sticking to it! No Bendy, no Watchy! I am Mecca and... Why do they have to do a re... re-continuation? Another continuation, a reimagining, a re reboot, a rebootquel, a sequel to Futurama in this day and age if you cannot get your original voice cast back. They got mostly everybody else. You all still have Zoidberg. But no, we have... No, John DiMaggio, a.k.a. Bender, a.k.a. the only reason to watch Futurama. Those could be anyone's thoughts, fat ass. No, John DiMaggio is Bender. This is a weird time we live in right now. This is a, what a time to be alive. I saw this article and I thought to myself, wait a minute. First off, Futurama had, uh, what, three or four good endings already. Every time the show has ended, they've wrapped it up with a movie or a continuation series. They kept bringing back movies. Quit squawking, Fleshwad. Nobody's forcing you to buy anything. They've already brought it back. It, it didn't need to continue. What are they going to do to Futurama in this day and age? Well, not bringing back one of the main voice cast. That's gonna ruin it. Everybody else is back. Billy West, Katie Seagal, Tress McNeil, Maurice LaMarche, Lauren Tom, Phil Lamar, and David Herman. Everybody else. Do I preach to you when you're lying stoned in the gutter? So he's in negotiations. This is what we know. This is what we know. There's gonna be a table read Monday. I'm recording this on a Thursday afternoon. There is a push in Hollywood from everybody from Star Wars to Star Trek to try and get John DiMaggio back. This might be just an attempt to get a higher negotiation contract being the star of the show. Bender the Offended doesn't need anybody. Knowing that everybody loves Bender, I mean, why not? Bender's great, right? Blah, 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 something Bender is great. Or this might be a publicity stunt to drum up support for a show that probably doesn't need to exist. I'm so torn on this. I don't want to watch a Futurama without Bender, without real Bender. Then again, I don't want to really watch another Futurama. I'm kind of, we, we've, we've done it. We've solved it. It's good. You don't need to bring it back. What are they going to do to it? We're going to be talking about what they're doing to Lord of the Rings after this. Stay tuned. What, pray tell, will they be doing with this? Peg Leg Pete says Bender was the smartest character. Bender was amazing. Everybody loved him. Even, even Mark Hamill is showing his support here. He's saying, please be reassured. I will not be auditioning for the role of fake Bender. You are one of a kind, pal. You know why? John DiMaggio is crapping livid. John DiMaggio is livid. <laughs> even spelled it wrong in their article. The voice actor who is known for Bender. That's his most famous role, probably. It's a little thing called style. Look it up sometime. Livid as fans are. He's as livid as fans are. There you go. That he's not returning for the Hulu revival. <sighs> we are livid. This is just a big slap in the face to anybody who would be like, oh, Futurama? I might get. Oh. oh. Really? Not to mention, what's wokier than now Hollywood gonna do to it in this day and age? What are they gonna do? What what what's the push for it? Oh, because there was one joke in there that that bending Bender bending Rodriguez was made in Mexico that they're gonna go. We need diversity. I'm Mexican and I find that offensive. Maybe we don't need Futurama back then if you can't have it the way it was before. But this is one of those cases where what dimension did I wake up in? I'm in 100% agreement with Tilly from Star Trek. Give him whatever he wants. John DiMaggio, who voices the foul-mouthed robot Bender among half a dozen characters, is not returning for the revival. So everybody in Hollywood is showing the support. That's a tweet for this stream. Watch this stream. We are live right now. The Deadline article. He's rallying frustrated fans by recasting the voice of Bender bending Rodriguez. Why? Why are we... Reca Why are we recasting? This is what I don't understand. In this day and age, when you have everybody, what is the point? Does it state it? Because it seems like they were in negotiations and then negotiations stopped. Maybe he asked for too much money. Maybe they, they decided to get a little bit irritating. Maybe 
Maybe he's got too many fans who are wrong think. You never know in Hollywood. While longtime Futurama voice actor John DiMaggio hasn't yet issued a statement regarding his absence from the Hulu series. Oh yeah, he did. He says he's livid. Happy birthday! Without John DiMaggio, Futurama and Hulu can bite my shiny metal ass, read one of the fans. That's where we're at. No, he said he, he's, he's livid. He seems to be livid. Get him, boys! And he even quote tweeted it. <sighs> we're all upset. We're all upset. I'm probably more interested in any of this because I am one of those people who can always tell when you recast somebody. Always. So the fact that this is what we're, what they're giving us. I can't, I can't fault fans who want to boycott it over the Bender stuff. I totally agree. I totally agree. And if it wasn't one of the cases where now I'm questioning, is this a publicity stunt? Is this for marketing? Is this to get people to trick people into watching something that shouldn't actually come back? I am super torn on this. What do you guys think? So I'm kind of triggered by this. Rob, you want to weigh in on the Bender stuff? Then we'll get into the Futurama. We're not doing a super long live today. We're just doing like an hour now. What do you think about Bender? Bender is great. <laughs> Bender is great. Bender is great. Bender is great. And, and oh, the green screen is not. <laughs> so Bender is great. Bender is great. Bender's like one of my favorite characters from from. Futurama from and anything from just about anything just because it's just oh my god he just, can, you, can you lean in yeah lean in lean in so yeah lean so in, yeah the bike so there look so look can, it's, 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 I just here. changed one letter on this shirt and it says bender and it says and look ender, ender. See? it says bender ender, but it says it says bender <laughs> hey bender hey fender <laughs> not fender bender bender okay so do you, do you think this is great. what do you yeah. think this is do you think this is a trick I, to get people to want to watch something that they don't I think they're trying to drum up interest. I think they're trying to hammer out a deal. I think they're. I think it's. I think they're. It's mainly publicity. I think it's. I think it's a lot to do with publicity. Trying to drum up. They're trying to. Oh, gauge. it's working! It's working because oh, like yeah. I actually really like Futurama, and I really I love Futurama. I thought Futurama was funnier than The Simpsons mm -hmm. for a while. Yeah, but it's so it's so easily wrapped up. I mean, it's it's completed. We have endings. Every mm -hmm. every time paradox is neatly tied up for everything, and I oh I loved how they did all that. The so smart. Yeah, eventually we're gonna see good news, everyone. Good news, everyone. You know, this. <laughs> that was how the one article started out when we saw this. Yeah. And I'm like, I, I wait a Somebody's minute. Somebody's a fan. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of those things where it's like, yes, I like Futurama. I would like more, but then again, it's like, but do I really need more in my life? My favorite one. My favorite one was when he went back to Roswell, New Mexico. Oh, that was good too. Yeah. Yeah. Fries his own oh, grandpa. Fries his own grandpa. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, now Spoiler. you're worried about it's m ruining history, Mr. I'm my own grandfather. Screw history! <laughs> <laughs> Screw history! See, we can watch and, and quote the old stuff. Do you remember? Oh, and thank you so much. How many times have we said it's be it'll be better with Blackjack and Hookers? <laughs> with Blackjack! And hookers. That's such a me well. Ben Bender is infinitely memeable. I think Bender is infinitely quotable, memeable. How many t things have we gotten from the remake or the reboot series of it though? Zero. I kind of remember Devo was in it, but I don't remember any specific episodes. I don't remember any specific plot I points. To, I don't remember anything I used to of when they came back. I used to walk around the house. Let me tell you the story about the Battle of Waterloo, and he was wanted to be a folk singer. <laughs> Whenever, whenever I, whenever I, I put salt on, I think I used, I used ten percent less than a lethal dose. <laughs> uh oh, I shouldn't have had seconds. It's time to get the people what they really want—a Millhouse spin-off show. Oh no, <laughs> no. Going through the car wash, I always sing "Robot Wash" instead. <laughs> Robot Wash. Oh. <clears throat> so if we have these really super iconic shows like this, what is the point of bringing them back? Nostalgia. Just for nostalgia, because they can't make anything new, because no. everything, like, we're, well, the next thing and, we're talking and, about is the nostalgia And merchandising, see? Like, and merchandise. I think they Bender. do that just so that you remember the thing and go Bender. buy a merchandise of it. Oh, Futurama's one of the perfect shows. It even had a cute. Oh, Nibbler. Yes, he's adorable! <laughs> I, still re I still regret not he getting the black little... Matter. I still re I re regret not getting, like, they had a... It was like the, the the figure of Nibbler. It was a plastic figure. It was like this tall. 
And I'm like, I should have bought it. It was ten bucks. Now they sell for way too much. Mm. Oh, I still for I still regret not getting him. He was so cute. They put the reboot me. gave shut up and take uh, shut up and take my money meme. That, okay, there's there's that one. There's that one. I forgot about he, that one. I stand he, corrected. Nibbler poops black dark matter, <laughs> which he used for fuel. I loved that. Cat, get on that. <laughs> he doesn't know how to do that. Yeah, some things just need to end where they end. Enough revivals. Yeah, uh, yeah that can... might be where I'm with this. It's like, I, I, and if they're doing this without John DiMaggio, I'm, I'm nah, just it's, completely. It's pointless. It's dead in the water. Do we have anything else on that, or do you want to move you can on do, to that? You could do, you could do Mash without without Frank Burns, without Trapper John, but you can't do Mash without Hawkeye. That's why I equate this to some some characters you gotta have. Mm. Bender is one of them. You could do it without Amy and Kip and or, you could probably, or, or Kip or, or whatever his name was. Kip. You could do it without you could do it without um, Well you're not gonna have Zap Brannigan or or yeah you are, huh? Well Zap Brannigan was always kinda just came in and out. Yeah. You can you can but you could you could get rid of some of these characters in the backgrounds, you know? Like like I wouldn't miss You wouldn't really miss Hermes. Yeah. You wouldn't miss him. You probably even Zoidberg, I probably wouldn't miss that much. You all still have Zoidberg. Bender I'd miss. Because Bender's the meat. Well, the big, th like the the big the three character. is Fry, Bender, and Leela. Mm -hmm. You know, you could even do it without Leela, to be honest. Like, I I hate to say it, just have well, a Fry I and a, Bender spin on I got a feeling by, by, by Monday we'll see good news, everyone. You know. Fans and... rallied and yada yada. Probably. All right. We're going back to the live chat. We got to talk about the Lord of the Rings. You stick around. Oh, do I have to? Hey, you're the one who knows anything about it. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. Thanks for watching! If you liked it, make sure to hit that like button, and if you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe! See you in the next video! Bye! Well, we're boned!